Man, go by the show. Kids, are you still here? Koto Noah, you're going to miss your train. Mom, I really don't feel like going to school today. Koto Noah, we've been over this. My regulars from the club are coming over today, and I can't have you kids stay here anymore while I conduct business meetings. <sighs> Can you at least not have them in my room this time? Aw, honey. Your room has the best bed. Now get. Well, well. Look who decided to show up for school today. Miss Perfect Complexion. Feel proud of yourself for investing in soaps and ointments to get rid of that pasty skin. What a freak. I... I, I don't... Oh! So your skin is naturally flawless. Like you're naturally equipped with those massive udders. Why can't you have a normal cup size like the rest of us? I bet her mommy bought her those breasts. Oh, right. She's a rich girl. <laughs> she probably took an entire fleet of ships to get them done in a foreign country. There's no way my family can afford that. We just bought a second yacht. <laughs> just got a second yacht. <laughs> Dear God, how can someone be so pathetic? Hey! Hey! Huh? You're Kotonoha, right? Yes. Sweet. I'm Sekai. You mind if I sit here? Uh, no. You know me? Not really, but one of my friends knows about you, so I wanted to meet you myself. I guess you're taking a break too. Coach was brutal with the laps today. Uh, are you okay? Sorry, I'm not feeling well right now. Sick? Depressed. Well, you know what cheers me up whenever I'm feeling down? Making fun of others. What? Here, I'll show you. Look at that one there. Damn, girl. If you want more attention from men, do a better job stuffing your bra. The blinds can tell they're lopsided. How was that? All right, a bit too close to home. How about that girl over there? Hey, have you ever heard of a razor? Because astronauts can see that bush from space. <laughs> see, it's working. Now you try. Oh no. Come on, that one's easy. No. Come on. No. Okay. <sighs> She's so dumb, she slits her wrists vertically instead of horizontally. <laughs> I'm not used to socializing. Well, how about we work on that? What do you say? Friend? <laughs> Friend? Sure! Want to hang out at lunch today? Y yes Hey, sis! Ah! Kokoro! Sorry, sis. You looked so happy today, and I wanted to know why. Happy? Yeah, you're usually so gloomy. Did something happen at school? Yes! I actually made a friend. I never had one of those before. Am I not your friend? What? No, I, uh... It's different. You're family, so you're my friend by default. Oh, I get it. So, are you and mom friends? Hey, how about I teach you how to drive the yacht this weekend? <gasps> Yay! I promise not to crash this one. So, you want a fancy knife at a karate competition? 
Yes, but the JKA didn't invest much time in selecting one since it was nothing more than a glorified fixed blade. A karambit or a tops knife would have been better suited for the occasion. Also, I know that they'll never do it, but I would love it if they offered a well-crafted neck knife as a championship prize. Uh, huh. Jesus. I, uh, also like knitting. See, that's a more normal hobby. Oh. Speaking of normal, is there any guy you have your sights set on? What? You know. What boy do you like? B -b but I... It's, uh... Do... Friends really talk about that? Of course! All the time. Now tell me who you're crushing on. Well, there is... One person. He usually rides the same train as me to school. Once in a while, I catch him staring at me, but there's no malice behind his gaze. No disgust. It almost makes me feel like... like I'm... actually normal. Recently, I caught one of his friends calling his name. I believe it was... Makoto. Jackpot. Hmm? Oh, nothing. Well, it's been fun, but I better leave before I miss my train. See you on the roof tomorrow? Uh, yes, but... what about you? What about me? Is there... someone you like? Oh! I guess there is one boy. I think his name is Tatsuya or something. I, I don't know. But hey, I'll talk to you later. I'll have something for you at lunch. Where is she? She's usually not this late. Oh, hey, babe. Ah! Oh my god, he's right in front of me. What do I say? What do I do? Oh my god, I'm so excited. I can't... Wow. Your back looks as good as your front. Hi, I'm Makoto. W wait, wait, no. You're, you're Makoto. I'm a, a... <sighs> I'm stupid. That's okay. I like him stupid. Thanks. So... I know we ride the same train, and Sekai told me you'll be up here, so... Sekai did this? Yeah, so anyway, I thought, hey, I have an excuse to talk to this girl, and now that I get to see you up close, all I have to say is... Damn. Oh. Damn means good. What? But I'm awkward, and I have weird skin, and I have a... large chest. Girl, those are some fine-ass titties. <gasps> Then he complimented the length of my skirt, and now we're going to spend Saturday afternoon exploring the town! Sounds like you had a very eventful lunch yesterday. Oh, it was! I can't believe I have a date with Makoto! Me! <laughs> and I have you to thank! Well, I wouldn't say that. No, I would never have had the courage to even approach Makoto! Thank you, thank you, thank you! You're the best thing to ever happen to me. Uh-huh. Oh, I wonder where we're going to stop by first. Well, I do need to buy more dress. Wait, if this movie's called Unholy Desires 8, do I need to see the other seven films to understand what's happening? Of course not. It's more of a standalone film. Okay, but did we have to watch this foreign film without subtitles? Let's just say this is the kind of movie that doesn't need subtitles. Okay, but- Oh! Uh, are... Th they are those w women, uh... What? Ha having s s s something indecent? <gasps> How could you think that? Those beautiful ladies are clearly partaking in the ancient art of... Wrestling. Wrestling? Sure, let's go with that. Well, I... Guess two women can't do that. This is the weirdest form of wrestling I've ever seen. Oh, I guess that would be an effective technique. This scene is making me feel weird. I didn't 
mean to. I'm so sorry. Oh, God. Oh, God. So, uh, well, I guess that movie really slapped. <laughs> Wow, that looked like a nasty fall. Well, our train should be coming soon, but if I help you pick all that up, we both might miss it. So, I'm gonna go on ahead. You should be alright getting all that. See you later, okay? Okay. Uh, hello? Hey, Sakai. Oh, Kotonoa! I forgot to save your number! Can we talk for a bit? I'm kind of busy at the moment. It's about Makoto. I'm listening. Well, we had our date today, and, uh, and he let me pay for both movie tickets to break social norms, and then, and then, um... Let me guess. You brought up the weird knife facts. No, I, he, uh, he grabbed my ch ch chest, and then I slapped him. Did I do something wrong? Uh, Sakai... Oh no, I'm still here. Listen, Makoto's just putting on an act. In fact, he loves chest women. Really? So I didn't ruin our relationship? Of course not. Just give him a few days, and everything will be back to normal. I'll talk to him myself to speed up the process. Oh, that's wonderful! Thank you, Sakai. You are such a wonderful friend. Yeah, sure, whatever. Bye. Uh, hi, Makoto. I haven't seen you on the train for a while, so I hope you're not sick. I, um, thought I saw you earlier, but the person just ran away as soon as I said your name. Weird, right? <laughs> I'm... I know Sakai said she would talk to you, but I am so sorry for Saturday. If you just give me another chance, I promise to be a better girlfriend, and I will never hurt you again. I hope you feel better. <sighs> Hello? Hey, Sakai. Oh, hey, Kotonoa. What's up? I haven't seen Makoto in over a week. I was just wondering if you know if he's okay. Oh, yeah. I've seen him once or twice, but... Don't worry, he should forgive you any day now. <laughs> Stop! I'm on the phone. <laughs> Sakai? Uh, sorry, I have a dog with me who needs some discipline. Woof. Is that... dog okay? He's just sick. In the head. But hey, I'll talk to you later. I have a dirty boy to attend to. Woof, woof. <laughs> Noah, you're still here? Yes. And you're back to this again. You were doing so well lately. You learned to smile. You were socializing. You were out of the house. Well, Sakai's busy, and my boyfriend... Oh, no. Have you at least called him? Yes, but he hasn't called back. <sighs> Typical gives you one night of passionate love and then hangs you out to dry just like your father mm. mom what oh um right just tell me if you need me to talk to that makoto boy i'll teach him a valuable lesson so kotonoha we noticed you haven't been doing much work for the festival. But... I have. Isn't it kind of messed up that you can get out of it because of your mom's donations to the school? That's not happening. Then it's settled. To make up for your poor work ethic, 
you'll complete all of our assigned tasks for the festival. And if you're fast enough, you can finish them right before lunch ends. The best part is that you'll build up some upper body strength to help carry those large fun bags of yours. No. What was that? I said, no, my lunch period is important and I will not give it up for you. Why? You can have lunch at any time with a school in your pocket. Oh, she's just running up to the roof to play with her imaginary friends. How pathetic. You can't even pay someone to be your friend. You're running because I'm right. Oh, yeah. The coast is right there. Oh, yeah, baby. I got a ticket to come town with your name on it. It's being delivered to right Calm down. I'm trying to... Come! Oh! Kodonoa! I didn't expect you to be here this early. We were just... Uh, uh... Wrestling! Yes! That's what we were doing. It's a new form of wrestling we were doing. <laughs> oh, right. It's just like that movie Makoto and I saw. Although it was two women doing the act. What movie did you show her? Shh. It's working. Well, I guess I'll see you both later. Uh... Yeah. Okay, bye! Fucking yes. Spotted. Wrestling. Oh, that was what it was. Wrestling. Sakai wouldn't lie to me. She wouldn't hurt me. She wouldn't fuck my boyfriend behind my back just like mom does with men on my bed. <laughs> no. Sakai loves me. She's my friend. My friend. Hi, Makoto. It's Kodonoa again. I know I already called you a few times today, but I thought, hey, a few more times couldn't hurt. <laughs> so, it feels like the school days have been dragging on a lot recently. It's almost as if I haven't seen you in weeks. Crazy, right? But if I'm being honest, every moment without you is agony. I know you feel the same way too. But hey, winter break is coming up, so we'll be together a lot more soon. Also, you know about Sakai? She's such a good friend, but I don't think she has any luck with men. Since she's the reason we're together, we should find someone for her. Then we can double date during the holidays. All of us. Together again. Oh shoot! Break just ended. I'll talk to you in a bit. Love you. Really? He's doing it again? Yeah. I literally caught that Makoto loser running out of the girls' locker room with panties on his head. You would think him having a girlfriend would stop that shit. Apparently not. Either Sekai needs to keep him on a shorter leash, or he needs therapy to get rid of that weird fetish of his. The fuck you looking at? I don't appreciate the lies you're spreading about my boyfriend. Boyfriend? Who would want to date your blubber chest having ass? I think she's talking about Makoto. <gasps> How precious! Hate to break it to you, princess, but that freak is currently dating Sekai. He's not a freak. And he's mine. Ooh! Alright, Kotonoa. We believe you. We do? We do. Oh, we do. In fact, we hope the whole school witnesses how loving your two's relationship really is. Well, as long as you don't make those mistakes again, we won't have any problems, will we? You promised you'd help me with my homework, remember? Oh. Right. Just give me a second. Oh, wait. What? I just got an email from Otome about the school festival. Well, it's CC to the whole school, so it might be important. Oh, it's a video. Maybe it's some kind of an- Oh my gosh, yes. Oh. Aren't those your friends? <laughs> They're wrestling! Just wrestling. 
<laughs> that looked a lot more like mom's business meetings. Where are my knives? Shit, shit, shit! Oh, what the fuck? God damn it! Hey, Sakai, are you all right? All right? All right? How the fuck can I be all right with that video circulating across the school? My social life is over! Oh, that video? It was just rustling. No one really cares about that. You think this is funny? Ha ha, Karma finally caught up with that slut, right? What are you talking about? Oh, don't you dare play dumb. You know exactly what that was. But it was just r rustling. You told me that it was. <gasps> How dense are you? Makoto cheated on you. We fucked. No. Please. He didn't need a wet blanket of a girlfriend who couldn't satisfy his needs. Oh no, I got scared because Makoto groped my chest a bit. Pathetic! But Sakai, you love me! Oh, I have actual shit to deal with now. I am done playing make-believe with you, you freak. God, fuck Atomi and her cronies. Those stupid whores deserve to die. What a freak. You're still here? Why can't you have a normal Am cover? I not your friend? How can someone be so pathetic? <laughs> Kotonoa, are you all right? She's doing fine. Look at me being a good parent. Um, Mom, my toast is stuck in the toaster. <sighs> then use one of your sister's knives to scrape it out. God. Hey there, Bazooka Tits. I'm guessing even you've heard the news by now. Such a shame. But we all have to face reality eventually. But hey. I can't exactly blame you for wanting him after the performance he gave. <laughs> Boy was giving it to Sekai so good. I'm even considering taking that loser out for a run myself. I... gotta... go. Those stupid whores deserve to die! This is some bull. The one day Otome's gang was assigned to clean up after the festival, they all mysteriously disappear. Now I'm stuck with all the grunt work. You know, I wouldn't put it past them that that was the reason they sent that sex video to the whole school. Seriously, who does that? Is expulsion really more appealing than carrying some boxes around for a few hours? Oh, oh you uh, scared me for a second there. Are you looking for someone or is you. there- me? You will teach me sex. Oh. Oh! Yeah, J just give me a second to finish up here and we'll now. go- Now! Yes, ma'am! Yes, Makoto! I need you inside me! I need to be inside you! This is kind of weird, but it is doing it for me! Oh, wow. Oh, that was great. So, you wanna go out somewhere on the weekend? Maybe see a movie? No. This was only physical. My heart belongs to another, so I must sever this connection to remain pure. Uh, that's fair. Well, I hope everything goes well with Permanently. You. Excuse me? And then I lined all their severed heads along the pier. The hard part was keeping crows away. So, how was your weekend? I'm sorry, but your film plan expired. 17. Days ago. Would you like to renew? Oh, Makoto, you're so cray cray. <laughs> Damn, 
That Minami lady was the best lay I ever had. Milfs never disappoint. Huh? When did it get so dark? <gasps> Makoto! In the flesh? I don't need you anymore. Why do you look familiar? Ooh, Booba. Yes, Makoto, I have returned. I wasn't ready before, but I have slain every hindrance on my way to becoming your ideal woman. Now we can finally unite as one, through body and soul. Hmm, something in the back of my head is screaming, run. But hey, I already went through most of the girls at school, so I might as well complete the set. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna grab something to eat, and then we'll get down to business. Huh. I don't remember making an entire feast for myself. Or knocking it all on the ground angrily. Or... vomiting? Uh, hey, sugar tits, can you get that? I'm busy making you a fantastic meal. You like floor food, right? Ow! That's hot! Fucking bitch! Uh-oh. You know for a fact that he's my boyfriend and you still chose to fuck him! What kind of self-absorbed skank does that? Sekai, you know you're my bitch. Oh, don't you you're my bitch me, asshole. I thought we were past this. If you can't even stop yourself from sticking it in every woman you see, how- And I how is this any different from what you've done to me? What? Oh, snap. He doesn't need a wet blanket of a girlfriend, right? Can't satisfy his needs, right? But this is different. What's different is while you were trying to chain Makoto down in some vain attempt to remain his exclusive girl, I have remolded myself to surpass every one of his desires so that I will be the only woman he'll ever need. Y yeah Well, I, uh... Now let me extend you the courtesy you didn't afford me. Your relationship is over. Makoto is my man. And I am going to fuck him until I shatter his pelvic bones! That is the sexiest thing a woman has said pertaining to me. But... I'm pregnant! What am I going to do? Oh, it's simple. Abort it, stupid whore! <gasps> oh my god, that's a great idea! I'll abort anything for you, Makoto. Anything. Break my pelvis, now! <sighs> oh, yes. oh god. Stop! Please stop! God, no! Oh god. entire afternoon together. I don't remember the last time we did that. Well, my boyfriend's busy this afternoon taking care of something important, so I might as well spend some time with you while I pick up cooking supplies for this evening. Ah, Makoto. I can't wait for you to have something I made inside you. I hope I have a boyfriend like Makoto when I'm what? older. You know, I want a boyfriend that makes me happy like you are with Makoto. Oh, that's what you meant. For a second there, I thought I had to end you. Just like those other thoughts. <laughs> oh, I forgot to pick up onions. Silly me. We better run back before the convenience store closes. Sis, do you know where mom went? So, Makoto, how did the trip to the abortion clinic go? Hopefully after this, Sakai will remember to keep her legs closed while she's around other people's boyfriends. Right? Ma... Go... To... You did nothing wrong. You did nothing wrong.
Do you know why I let you live? Even though you caused me so much pain, you were the first person to make me smile. I also wanted you to suffer! <laughs> Mistake. All right, Kotonoa. Let's just go home and forget. Oh, we're way past the bargaining stage. But first, a gift. Go on. Open it. <laughs> oh God! Look at it. Look at what you did! That's... That's not on me! Then why? Why is he... He was an asshole. He was the love of my life! Oh, Makoto. Soon, we'll be together again. <laughs> I was in a dark place when I wrote that. Hello everyone, I'm not Team Four Star. Thank you all for watching, and I would like to take a moment to thank all the wonderful voiceover artists from Casting Call Club who helped make this possible. Also, huge shout out to Kicker Kibaz who created the thumbnail art for this video. Her socials are down in the description. While you're here, if you want to subscribe, I have a second channel called Bit Info. You can subscribe to as well, just in case something happens to this channel, since it is a predominantly a British channel. As for future projects, later this year, I plan on starting production on my next a British series. No, it's not Dragon Ball related. This is going to be my largest project yet. So there will not be any video uploads on this channel for a few years because I want to release the episodes on either a weekly or semi-weekly basis instead of releasing one episode every few months. Updates will be on my Patreon once significant progress is made. Once again, thank you everyone who helped make this video possible and thank you all for watching. And as always, support the official release. Say what?